two single beers. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Multiple stains on and a ripping half. <laughs> Three star this one. What's your... Oh wow, they're awesome, aren't they? Don't look too bad, does it? Actually, here's the gym. I think it is a big, big gym. <laughs> Perfect place if you've got kiddies. Check it out. It's the kiddies area. Here's the man on the horse. The horsey man. This jellyfish looks like an alien. <laughs> I'm coming for your species. The lovely uh, sunset over here with a beautiful rubbish bin. <laughs> Mum's just uh, got the pineapple. I've got a uh, yum for pool, which is the wing bean salad. There we go. Just got out of the car. Let's cool pictures on the wall. Wicked. Okay, copper market. Wi Fi Okay. Okay, cool. Copper market. Check it out. Here's our, our room then. Tiny room, this one. That's a a good price. <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> Two single beers. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I don't want to be that close to mother. No offence, mother. <laughs> You're snoring. goes right in my bloody ear. <laughs> so yeah, tiny AF room. But yeah, you've got TV. You've got a nice uh, sofa. That's got multiple stains on and a ripping half. <laughs> oh dear. But uh, yeah, got a mini fridge, so that's all right. Got some water. Got the smelly whatnots. We've got um, a fat guy in a mirror. Look at that belly. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> and then... Huh? No, I definitely won't enjoy that shower as much as the last one. Oh, look at that. How depressing is that? Look at that compared to the Amari. Bloody hell. But you get what you pay for. So, yeah, there's our, this is our semi sort of a budget uh, hotel. It's obviously, we evened it out the, the trip price with uh, the Amari one. So, obviously, that's a, a four, four and a half star. This one's probably, uh, I think it was three star, this one. What's your. Huh? I think it was a three star. I'll have to double check on that one. But, uh, yeah, well, it's, it's clean anyway. It's. Um, yeah, it's hot and I'm hot and I'm getting sweat in my eyes again. But um, yeah, I'm just gonna have to try and move these uh, apart because friggin' hell, bloody hell, mum snores like a friggin' <laughs> I don't know what's what makes horrible, Osh not ostrich, elephant, buffalo. <laughs> 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 oh dear, anyway, I'm going to put this bag down now, it's heavy, and uh, get settled in, and I'll see you in a bit, cheers. Uh, check it out guys, I've had a little rest in the room, I just walked to the end of the corridor, obviously it's much better this side, but obviously more expensive. Uh, yeah, check out the sea today, banana boat. There's a reception area, come down there, you've got a toy machine, and you've got a drinks machine, and snack machine if you want. Check out that, that's awesome, what do you call it, mural, mural or something? Of elephants, wicked. Here we go, what's this? Kids Club Fitness and Sauna. Okay, wicked. Oh wow, they're awesome, aren't they? Check out these guys, they're oh, wicked. Man, I'd love a plant pot like that. Look at that, that is just wicked. That is so cool. Yeah, that is awesome, isn't it? Look, there's all of them, they go all the way down. They are so cool. Oh man, look at that. <laughs> They'd look great in the garden, wouldn't they? Bloody hell. Here we come up here. Oh, there's the pool. Oh, don't look too bad, does it, actually? Oh, that's like the one in uh, Hall Him we stayed at a couple of years ago when it came out. There you go, nice little pool, actually. Out the sun, but nice. Out gym, here's the gym. See what the gym's like. Slad. Let's respect social distancing, shut up. Oh, <laughs> I was thinking it was a big, big gym. <laughs> oh, dear. So, obviously, there's a, a leg press machine with nothing on it. Oh, oh you twat. So yeah, <laughs> I've just been a complete bog. I didn't know it was connected to the doodle. So obviously, yeah, leg press. So obviously, multifunctional one. Obviously, you've got the uh, the leg press and everything. You've got the lats uh, pull down, uh, flies, obviously curls, leg raises, whatever you want to do, bicep curls. You've got a bench, and we've got a few weights that go up to, how much are they? 30 kilos? That's not 30 kilos. Honestly, it's 30 pounds. Yeah, that's 30 pounds. That's not 30 kilos. Rawr, yeah. Yeah, a little bit lighter on the weights, but a oh, small hotel gym, good price. It's pretty hot in here. I was about to say, there's someone else next to you there, Mum. <laughs> You've got a twin sister. <laughs> so, oh, yeah. Obviously, your uh, treadmill and your uh, cross trainer. Got to have that in the gym over here. Anyway, multifunctional uh, piece of equipment. I say for a hotel gym, does everything you want really, so not bad at all. So I say, especially for a budget, budget hotel, not bad at all. Wicked. And uh, check out this, there's a kiddies area if you want. Look at that, awesome. Perfect if you've got kids, check out that. Friggin' floor, you've got all the, the ball section and everything, the slide in there. Wow, drawings. Yeah, it's a perfect place if you've got kiddies. Oh look, they've got TV bits and those uh, capsule things. Respect social distancing, come on bloody hell, it's 2024, you bloody mongs. 10 people an hour for crying out loud. Oh, and they've got a uh, sauna room gent. Really? 
Ooh, a bit creepy in here. There's a toilet in that bit, it's a bit smelly. There's a shower here. And here's the, the sauna, or the sauna. Well, that's pretty warm. Oh, it's all on already, wicked. I might have a go on that. That's nice. Oh yeah, you can feel the heat out of that, bloody hell. Lovely sauna. Sauna's absolutely amazing for you, so get a sauna in if you can. So good for your friggin' health. It's absolutely amazing, the benefits of sauna. Oh yeah, definitely get your sauna in. And you can't find the entrance to the swimming pool. All these ones here are like from the people's, um, obviously, apartment. They're the luxury rooms that they're staying at, but we can't just find a way in. It must be up there somewhere. All right, let's have a butcher's around this side. So there you go, that's why we can't find it on the ground floor. <laughs> to check it out, it's the kiddies area. Obviously you've got the slide and everything, and the sand pit down there. Yeah, another slide there. Got the little pool. Awesome, look at that little slide. Check it out, and here's the main pool. There's a little pit. Oh, oh here's the jacuzzi. Oh, they got the, oh, that's a shame, isn't it? Oh, there you go, you can't sit here, unfortunately. Well, you can sit there, you just can't get a drink. And there's the, the pool over there. Wicked. They should have made an entrance over there, to be fair, though. Should have, should have put a, uh, yeah, what's it called? Those bloody get out steps things. These things, ladders, there you go. <laughs> Alright, check it out, so I just literally walked across the road from the hotel and here we are on the beach, absolutely amazing. Yeah, Chatham Beach, a little bit more relaxed than Hoi Hin, but still nice nonetheless. So yeah, quite different each way you go. Uh, this side up all by the fishing village and everything gets quite different, very, very quiet up there. And uh, yeah, this side is a little bit uh, busier. It's a little bit thinner as well, the beach down there, sort of, uh, not as wide. But so yeah, this time seems a lot more people than before. Yeah, for the last few years, obviously, I had all this COVID drama, but uh, it hasn't been quite as busy. This is the busiest I've seen Chatham for absolutely friggin' ages. Absolutely friggin' ages. Anyway, enough of my annoying head. Um, yeah, you probably can't hear me anyway because of the bloody wind. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to show you some of the, the viewage. Check this out. Check this out. <laughs> Check this out. Yeah, as you can see, check it out. It's quite rough to see, but uh, obviously it's out a little bit. Oh, check it out, we've still got the horses over here, like we do in uh, Hohin. Hohin's only like a 40 minute sort of drive away, depending on traffic. There's a banana boat over there as well, who does not like a banana boat. <laughs> oh, yes, here's the man on the horse, the horsey man. Mother just made it, struggling with her back a bit. Oh, nice. Oh, so busy today, so busy. Oh, and here's the horsey. Yeah, check it out guys, so we're just heading up the beach now down to a Roy restaurant, one of my favourite restaurants, probably the number one restaurant now in all of Thailand. Great food, great price, it's absolutely amazing. Anyway, we were going to go back up to the room, but we thought we're on the beach, so why not just carry on down there. So I do apologise for mum's attire. She didn't get dressed, she didn't put a dress on for dinner. I mean, it's quite, quite bloody, no, it's terrible really, isn't it? Terrible, I mean, cried out loud, mum. You could at least like a tighten yourself up a bit for dinner, I mean. Ridiculous. <laughs> anyway, uh, so yeah, we're just heading off down to the restaurant and uh, unless there's anything else interesting on the way, I will see you there. Oh, bugger, I forgot every bloody year I like write uh, the name and the place in the sand and I forgot to do it. So uh, yeah, let's pretend we're in Huahin again. <laughs> there you go. We're here in 2024, well done. We're here in 2024 in Shutdown. <laughs> Check out this. This jellyfish looks like an alien face, oh my word. It's come from another planet to die on the beach. Yeah, I'm not saying it's aliens. This is nut. <laughs> Does look like an alien face though, that is pretty cool. <laughs> Probably been attacked by the horse or something. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm coming for your species. Brains are. Oh, well, I mean, we ain't got any of that on this planet anymore, so yeah, maybe go to another planet. <laughs> These are awesome, by the way, for kids. Check them out. The guy just makes them for polystyrene, paints them up a little bit, and obviously they fly like that. How cool is that? Wicked. So simple, so easy. Oh, uh, yeah. Come on up to the end of the, the beachy part now, right up here. Then we come up and do a right. Yeah. Oh my god, check out that one. Whoa, nearly walked through to that. Look at that. Completely destroyed jellyfish again. Bloody hell. Woo! By the way, guys, we stayed here before as well, this hotel, so check out that video. Nice hotel inside. Breakfast, not that great though.
there we go got the lovely uh, sunset over here with a beautiful rubbish bin beautiful views <laughs> anyway there's a roy restaurant just down there see you inside check it out guys it's my favorite restaurant now a roy restaurant mum's just uh, got the pineapple in well, pineapple with the pineapple rice with cashews and everything curry is absolutely delicious some chicken in there as well I've got a yum tua pool, which is the wing bean salad. Absolutely delicious as hell. This is so good. It's quite not it's quite spicy though, so be wary of that. There you go, check it out. Oh yes. And you've got two more dishes coming as well in a second. And check it out guys, this one's a gay tart some warm prey. So gay tart is the, the fried chicken and some warm prey is um the, the herbs and they deep fry them crispy. And you got like kaffir lime leaf. You got lemongrass, garlic, peppercorns, basil. Oh my god, this is so good. You definitely got to try this dish if you're in uh, Thailand. It's one of the best low carb keto uh, Thai choices to have when you're eating Thai food out in a restaurant. Unfortunately, it's not like the most uh, common of dishes, which is a real pain, really, because it's absolutely freaking fabulous. So, definitely check this dish out if you can, if you want some low carb. Uh, Thai food and stay tuned for a recipe. I'll be making this recipe soon, so I'll tell you how to make it. Obviously, it's what a recipe is, <laughs> so make sure you stay tuned for that because you're not going to want to miss it. Absolutely delicious. Oh, I forgot to say, just having a Chang beer as well. Check it out. Got to have a beer with Thai food. And there we go then guys, just finished eating at a Roy restaurant, it really is absolutely amazing, it's like five star food at absolutely bargain bargain prices, you definitely got to check this restaurant out if you come to Cha Am. Anyway, we're just going to head back for a little walk along the beach before we're he heading back to the hotel, obviously, got to walk, it's about a 10 minute walk away or something, 15 minute walk away, so uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, thanks for watching, take care, stay cool, and I'll see you on tomorrow's video. Chicka bow 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 bow. <laughs>